What's going on? So, I had another run-in with the VA medical system yesterday, and let me tell you about it. So for those of you that don't know, I was in the Marine Corps for five years. Um, in Afghanistan, I rolled my ankles about a thousand times a day. I don't know why, something about the ground over there, I was just constant, both feet just, uh, oh man, it was brutal. Well, I, I'm pretty sure I'm paying for that now because my tendons in my feet are totally fucked. Uh, this has been a ongoing thing for about five years now. I have partially torn Achilles tendons in both feet. I have plantar fasciitis in both feet. Basically, my feet are totally jacked, and every once in a while, they decide to go, fuck you, man, and really wreck my shit. Uh, they'll swell up, they hurt like a motherfucker, lasts a week or two usually, and then it goes away, and I'm good to go. Well, for the longest time, I didn't really have any reprieve from this. I just kind of had to deal with it. So I got out of the Marine Corps, found a doctor locally that was giving me meds for the pain. The only thing I've found that works are narcotics, and I know that's like a terrible word these days because politics, but I don't give a shit. I actually need the fucking things. I'm not a junkie. I'm not hooked on the fucking things. I'm not selling them. I'm, all that bullshit around the politics doesn't apply to me at all, but it's affecting me. I can't get the meds that work anymore. My foot's the size of a fucking football. And was so damn swollen the other day after I got home from work, the pattern on my socks was imprinted on my foot. After about four hours of agony, I was like, you know what, fuck this. Me and the wife went to the VA, ER, and uh, what a waste of time. They, they just completely don't give a shit. I go in, you know, we wait about an hour to be seen. That's eh, fine, it's par for the course when it comes to ERs as far as I know. No big deal, I can deal with that. I'm like writhing in agony. Like, it hurt so fucking bad, I couldn't even sit still. I was breathing heavy, my blood pressure was through the roof, I actually had a fever. I mean, it, it was crazy, like it hurt so fucking bad. I go in and, and they're like, so what's going on? And I point to my foot that's like huge and red and I'm like, uh, yeah. Tendon issue, been going on for years and years and years. This is how we fix it. This is what I've done. I just had an x-ray like a week and a half ago at that very fucking hospital. So on and so forth. You know, all the all the normal shit. It's like it went in one ear and out the other. They, they It didn't even register. What do they do? They send me up for an x-ray. And I'm like, okay guys, I just had a fucking x-ray. Why am I going to get another x-ray? I had one a week and a half ago. Why are we doing this again? No pain meds, no nothing. They insist on wheeling me up to get a fucking x-ray again. I was pissed. Well, like, you stupid bitches. So we go up and do that. We come back down. I sit there again for another probably 20 minutes or so. And Dr. Dickhead shows up. His name's Dr. Saba. Total asshole. He's standing, like, I, the bed's up against one wall. And he's, like, leaning up against the other wall, like, probably 10 feet from me, it seemed like. And he's like, so what's going on? And... Because I was like breathing heavy and all kinds of shit was going on, my voice, which is still kind of scratchy and kind of fucked up, my voice was kind of like half gone. And he kept going, what? 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 I couldn't help but think I'm going to knock your fucking mustache off your face if you don't quit being a cocksucker. So he, he's poking and prodding and I'm like, dude, please stop that. <laughs> well, I need to look. Dude was a total fucking asshole. And all of this for nothing. For nothing. They gave me some shot of some uh, anti-inflammatory thing that did basically fuck all and sent me home with some crutches. It's, it's unreal. The other time that I went to the hospital, to the ER, was for my feet. This foot, the bottom, the plantar fasciitis was like, it was huge. It was red. And, oh my God, it hurt so fucking bad. Went to the ER for that. No shit. X-rays and Motrin. I fucking walked out. I couldn't believe that shit. It's just like in the military. No shit, your fucking leg could fall off. They're going to be like, uh, x-rays and Motrin. It blows my fucking mind. I don't know if they're stupid or if they just really give that little of a shit. So, as far as I'm concerned, the VA medical system still needs a big, big change. The biggest change, they need to give a shit. Because they clearly don't give a flying fuck. 
Some of the nurses there were fucking awesome. The guy that checked me in, the nurse that checked me in, was looking at it like, uh, dude, you, um, yeah. Well, the, the dude that wheeled me up to the fucking x-ray, I almost feel bad for him because I was like, I wasn't rude or mean or anything, but I was fucking telling him what was going on. And he, he just kind of was like, all in all, it's just a total waste. I will never go to the fucking VA, ER again, ever. Because it is a total waste of my fucking life. I'll happily pay the fucking whatever the hell thousand dollars or whatever to go to the real ER because theoretically at least they'll give a half a shit.